I need Joyce. I need help. Got no energy. Sleeping all day. Headaches. Oh, I don't feel happy. Your body's changed since you had that accident. You need to make good choices to keep yourself healthy. You're smoking and drinking when you go to town. And I know you boys are using ganja. Oh, it's not every day, Arnie. Sometimes young fellas gotta have a bit of a party. JJ, smoking, grog, ganja, they hurt everyone. But for you, it's worse. Your body can't fix itself quickly from big sessions. You take medicine every day, JJ. The medicine doesn't work when you drink grog. Yeah, I remember the doctor telling me that. But I thought a little bit won't hurt. Even a little bit of grog causes problems. After you drink a little bit, you think more grog's okay. Then you don't care. Fighting starts. You can fall over and hit your head again. I know smoking's bad. I'll stop in a few years. But smoking is a problem for you now. Smoking means you'll be short of breath and you can get infections that will send you back to a hospital. Arnie, I don't have the strength to say no to grog and gunja and smokes. My life's different since the accident. I can't play football, I can't drive a car. I've got pain in my back all the time. I get very sad. When I'm drunk and stoned, I feel better for a while. I'm with my mates, no pain. But how do you feel the next day? Oh, no good, auntie. Well, that's when I think a lot about my accident. I get bad headaches and I can't see properly. Money's all gone. Shame job. I just want to get stoned again so I feel better. JJ, are you ready to live your life in a different way? I can get help for you. This is part of my job as a carer. You need to talk to men that you respect. Uncle Bill or Jason Wilson. They're living strong lives, looking after families and taking care of country. Uncle Bill used to be a drinker. He stopped for 10 years now. Jason went to college with you. Now he's working for Centrelink and making good money. Uh, is there any medicine to help me stop smoking and drinking? Yes, I can take you to the clinic to talk to the health workers. But it's not just medicine you need. Getting exercise each day. Getting enough sleep. Eating healthy food. Drinking water. Small changes can make a big difference. Okay, and I like doing Friday disco for the kids. People appreciate the work I do. JJ, we need young people like you to stay strong because you'll be leading the community one day.